Organizational charts are great for documenting reporting relationships within a company and make it easy to identify fellow employees and obtain a clear understanding of how they relate to everyone else within the organization. And you can build them quickly and easily with SmartDraw. To begin, click on one of the org chart templates. You can also start an org chart in any open document by selecting Add Blueprint Diagram here on the left and choosing the org chart option. We are starting with an org chart template that lays out a basic hierarchy, starting with a manager, direct subordinates to the manager, and more tiers below them representing employees that report to the tier above. Simply click on a box and type to add that employee's name and title. Tab or arrow between the boxes to fill out the rest of them. Click on these yellow quick add control arrows to add more shapes in any direction. Whether above, below, or horizontally, the rest of the chart adjusts accordingly and stays evenly spaced. You can also press Ctrl and the arrow keys on your keyboard to add shapes that way. When you add, delete, or move shapes around, the rest of the chart reformats automatically, always looking neat and orderly. Here in the Smart panel, there are more options to help you build an org chart. Under the Import and Export palette, you can import data from a local CSV or XLSX file or directly from Azure Active Directory to build your diagram automatically from that data. You can also export the data within your chart as a text file. Under the Employee Properties palette, you can add an assistant to an employee with a box placed directly below them but separate from the rest of the subordinates. You can also add a co-manager, which places a connected box on the same tier as that employee. There is also a Make Same Size option, which makes all of your shapes the same size with one click. You can add a picture to each shape to personalize your org chart with images. And you can use this dotted line tool to illustrate secondary relationships between employees, or situational conditions under which an employee may report to another manager. You'll find other ways to format your shapes under the Shape Format palette. You can change the chart direction and branch style in the Org Chart Layout palette. And you can adjust the spacing of your chart under the Spacing palette. At any point, you can easily change the style of your shapes, theme, fill color, and line style up here in the main toolbar. You can add additional org charts or any other kind of diagram blueprint, diagrams from data, or whiteboard blueprints to your workspace by clicking on the Add button here on the left bar and choosing from among those options. For instance, you can add a brain writing and a flowchart blueprint anywhere in the workspace and build from there. When you select those blueprints, the controls in the Smart Panel automatically switch to those that will help you build that kind of visual. These tools will help you work more effectively with your coworkers and better communicate the relationships in your organization.